Hi guys, this is Jazz with Five West Media Group. Today, I want to talk about Instagram Reels. Instagram Reels was just released last week by Instagram. Um, that is Facebook slash Instagram's response to the app TikTok. Now, for some of you that don't know, so TikTok, um, actually the app was the most downloaded app ever in a quarter, um, in the first quarter of 2020 this year, actually. And, um, you know, obviously Facebook wants a piece of that pie. Now, Facebook had released a, a very similar app. Um, I think it was last year and it was called Lasso. It didn't really take off. The concept was very similar to TikToks, but for some reason it just, it just couldn't really, uh, gain foot. And so, um, but now with Instagram reels, um, we really do believe that this, um, is something to look into and to definitely jump on. Um, you know, for businesses, anytime something like this comes up and a platform introduces a new tool for you to use on their platform, it's something that you should do because the, the reach and the engagement on those, um, on those new tools, like I'm going to say when Facebook, uh, you know, introduced live videos, then they were pushing live videos with their algorithm. And so more people were seeing your content um, because they obviously want more people to see it and to use that tool. And so the same concept is now with Instagram Reels. You definitely want to jump on it. You want to make some Reels for your business um, to push your content out. And maybe you can gain, uh, you know, grab more clients that way. You can get more reach on your platform um, and help your business thrive. So just wanted to give you that helpful tip for today. It's short and sweet. Have a blessed day. Bye. Hey everyone, I'm Jess from Later and today I'm going to be walking you through everything you need to know to post your very first Instagram Reel. So what is Instagram Reels? Instagram Reels is their latest video feature that allows users to film up to 15 second video clips set to music on Instagram. The latest video feature is available in Brazil, India, Germany, and France, and with its most recent announcement, the United States. Instagram also promises a rollout in additional countries in the coming weeks, so stay tuned. Well, with that, let's get right into the video. If this concept sounds a little familiar, you're not that far off. Almost everyone is comparing Instagram Reels to TikTok. So here's a look at Instagram's top Reels feed. It's a separate video feed where you can see videos from all accounts on Instagram, even those that you don't follow. To get started, we're gonna open up the Instagram app on our phone and then tap right into the explore page. As you can see, there's the big video with the reels icon in the bottom left. Go ahead and tap on the video. So now we are on Instagram top reels feed. If you've ever been on TikTok, this is very similar to TikTok's for you page. As you scroll through reels, you can interact with the videos just like you would with the regular feed. Double tap to like or tap the heart in the bottom left corner. If you want to leave a comment, just tap on the voice bubble right next to it. And you can also have a scroll through and see what other people have to say about the reel. And tap on the paper airplane to add the video to your story or direct message it to friends. If you see a video you don't like, tap the three dots in the bottom left corner and let Instagram know that you don't like it by tapping not interested. While the Reels algorithm hasn't been locked down just yet, it's likely influenced by who you already follow, what content you interact with, what you're interested in, and where you're located. If you see a video with the song you want to use, simply tap on the song underneath the caption. You'll be brought to this page, and when you tap Use Audio, you will be able to create a Reel using that music. Now it's time to make our Instagram Reel. So you're going to want to go to your home feed and swipe just like you would to add an Instagram story. Then we're gonna scroll over to the new Reels tab. Once here, this is where we're gonna edit, film, and upload all of our video clips. Let's walk through all of the editing tools together. We can see how Instagram has audio, speed, effects, and timer tools to the left of the screen. Tap on audio to access Instagram's music. Here you can see the suggestions and you can also hop on over to the browse tab and search for a specific genre, artist, or song. So once you've selected a song, then you can go back and choose what part of the song you want to use for your reel. Next, tap on the play button to adjust your video speed. Here you can see you can make it fast, slow motion, but we're just going to keep it regular speed to keep it simple. Just like on Instagram stories, you can play around and use different effects on your reel. So you can use any of your saved effects or you can scroll to the end 
and tap on browse effects here, search through Instagram's effect gallery and pick one from there. Or you can just use one of your own. We're gonna use beach tan camera. Lastly, tap on timer. This is where we can set the duration of our first clip by dragging the timer just like so. Let's make our clip five seconds and then select set timer. When you tap record, you're gonna see this three second countdown and now you are recording. So it will go for the five second duration or whatever duration you set it to. Now that we have finished filming our first clip, we can review it by tapping the back arrow to the left of the record button. Here, you could trim the video or trash it if you're not happy with how it turned out. Now it's time to film the next clip. Instagram wipes your previous settings, so if you do wanna use the same ones, you do have to go and input it all in again. We're gonna start off with our speed, then our effects, we wanna keep the same one, and then lastly, our timer. We are gonna go ahead and set our second timer to 10 seconds, and then tap set timer. If you're happy with all your settings, which we are, we are ready to record our second clip. So I'm just gonna get into position, tap record, and then I'm gonna see that same three second timer. After you finish filming your second or last clip in this case, you can tap the back arrow again and trim or delete the clip. All right, and there you have it. Our filming is complete. Similar to Instagram stories, you can use the draw and the text tool, and you can also choose from a number of Instagram stickers. Tap the sticker icon in the top right to select a sticker for your reel. Let's go with the heart. Then you can get creative by using the draw tool, select it and draw on your reel just like you would an Instagram story. Add text to your videos by selecting the text tool. Position the text on the screen where you like it and then use the slider at the very bottom to actually select the duration for how long you want the text on the screen. When you see faded text like this, that just means that that text is not going to be in that clip in the finished product, so don't worry. Now you can play it back once more to make sure you're happy with the finished product and if it's looking good, tap the next arrow in the bottom right. Captions are everything, so we're gonna go ahead and write a short and sweet caption with a few hashtags and then go ahead and change the cover photo. To select a cover, tap on the cover and then either choose a frame from the video or upload an image from your camera roll. We're gonna choose this frame and then tap done. Share your reels to your Instagram stories by sliding over to the stories tab and then selecting your story. Your Instagram reel will automatically share to the explore page and the reels tab on your profile, but you can also choose to share it on the home feed by selecting also share to feed. Once you've decided, go ahead and tap share. And that's it, now we just wait for it to upload. And there you have it, your masterpiece is up. You can find your reel on the new Instagram Reels tab on your profile right here. Thanks so much for watching and we really hope this tutorial helps you and we can't wait to see what you create on Instagram Reels.